all right what is up guys welcome back to another video on this channel today i'm going to show you guys how to get double movement in fortnite chapter 3 it's going to be a really quick video so if this does help you in any way uh, make sure to leave a like so this gets across more people and subscribe if you haven't already we're trying to hit 10k and we're getting closer and closer so yeah today i'm going to show you guys how to get uh double movement in fortnite chapter 3 like i said so i'm going to try to do this as quick as possible here um i'm going to show you guys step by step how to do it it won't be complicated at all it's really easy to do so what we're going to do is go into Google Chrome. I'm going to leave a link for you guys in the description that you guys can just click on and it will send you straight to the download link. Here is the link right here. Uh, I'm going to leave this link in the description. Like I said, um, you're going to scroll down a little bit, click download now and a new thing should open up. And after that, this should start installing. Um, it should take a couple of seconds depending on your internet, but just wait for this to finish and open it up as soon as it is done. As you can see, this only popped up because I have double movement already running. So I just have to close this. Um, just for it to reinstall. All right, so as soon as you install it, it should automatically open up. Um, this is what it looks like. Yours might look like this, but mine just looks like this because I have dark mode on. Um, what you're gonna want to do is have Fortnite open, and I'm gonna show you guys what you need to do in Fortnite for it to actually start working. Where you can move around like this. All right, so what you're gonna do is go into settings and go over to the mouse and keyboard settings. And what we're gonna do is put ignore gamepad input on off. Then you're gonna put lock input method as mouse on on and then you're going to go over to your keybinds and you are going to exit out all these so yours should look like this w a s and d that's what you should look like just click all these x's on all four of those click apply and it should start working where you can move a lot i can't even edit but if you can move a lot smoother and stuff and you can obviously change like the striping amount for your movement so i'm going to show you guys how to do that right now and i'm going to show you guys what i use so you're going to go under advanced mode and these are the keybinds W, S, and D. These should be the default ones. Um, if they're not like that, just click them and apply them. Then you're going to go to strafing. Now you can enable a single key strafing. I'm not sure what this does, honestly. I'm not like a pro with this kind of stuff, but um, you can enable that if you want. And then strafe angle, I have mine at 62%. Now basically, if you put yours to 100%, like right here, I'm going to show you guys right now. You can literally look like straight forward and still run way to the side, but like... If you try and switch through, like moving, it's a little bit harder to do. Like you kind of have to like break in between. But I'm pretty sure 62 is like the maximum you can go without having to like do that kind of stuff. So let me try and like do that. So as you can see, you can just go straight left and right, back and forth without having to like stop. So you can go full speed the entire time, um, basically doing that. But yeah, other than that, you can add a, a hotkey to enable it. But that is pretty much all you need for this kind of stuff. This is all you need. Um, you can minimize it, it will close, it'll go in your system tray in the bottom here. And that's all you need to get double movement in Fortnite chapter three. It's very easy to do. There is keys to X input, I know that, but I think double movement on the wooding is a lot better. Um, so yeah, I just use that instead. But yeah, when you're like tarping kind of stuff like that, it's just like a lot easier to like move around. Like you will notice if I try and turn my double movement up right now, I have to reassign my keys, but if I try and do that, if I hit control P and I try and run around like this, it's just so stiff. This is me holding down A and D. If you just barely move, like you have to be looking a certain way to move. It's just horrible. I can see my movement is a lot worse. This isn't even me trying to be shit. It's just maybe I am shit. But yeah, you can barely move like it's just horrible. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, leave a like, like I said earlier and subscribe. And we will catch you in the next one. Peace out.